What is going on everyone and welcome to my first uh, synthesis Path of Exile video. So I decided to do about three days worth of uh, just playing off camera and I figured let's just get to the point where we could do maps because that's the fun part anyway. So we are level 81. We're playing an Essence Strain Contagion build. Um, the build is not done. In fact, I'm like far from geared and like I need a lot more help. So, level 81 right now, uh, this is the new Synthesis League, and it's actually pretty fun. It's kind of simple compared to, like, Betrayal, and uh, there's not as many, like, different things happening as once, but the whole concept of Synthesis is pretty cool, and I'll try to explain more a little bit later as we get to it. So, um, yeah, this is my Essence String Contagion build. Basically, this is Contagion, hit enemies with it. Big AoE, they start taking chaos damage, then you hit them with an essence drain, everything explodes. Um, and yeah, so overall, that's pretty much the idea of the build. Um, in terms of gear, it's not really geared. I'm level 81, still using a tabula, which is pretty bad. Um, so yeah, still need to get geared. I have not done the Uber Lab yet, I'm still trying to find the. Uh, labyrinth trial thingies and I have like two out of six so I just got to find them at this point so let's do what we can all the maps that we currently have we'll do like a tier three ley line is not that bad so in terms of like my path of exile like knowledge I've done every single map in the game um, I've done multiple leagues of this so you guys can watch everything last league for betrayal I did a glacial cascade totem build made it to like 93 or something and you guys can see basically all the maps that I've done but yeah so for all of you who are new to Path of Exile you can check it out and this is basically how the build works you hit things with the contagion hit them with an essence drain the map blows up sometimes it hits multiple screens of enemies which is kind of cool and in terms of flasks, I'm not really sure like what um, what flasks I should be using. I know that some people use the armor one, and some people use the evasion one. I've been told that armor does not scale properly, or it's just not as great, or it is like some sort of cap, whereas evasion is just evasion. But anyway, mostly what I'm trying to go for is just getting geared. None of the stuff I have is optimal, and it's just kind of scary because mid 80s I should be geared. So the theme of this league, as you guys know, is synthesis, which means fragmented memories, and you kind of combine them all together, and you get to make your own maps, which I'll show you in a bit. So every map. Kavas comes out and you have to do a fragmented memory and once you start it you have a number of bridges so like the thing stabilizes right here um, it'll tell you how many there are total so they're called bridges oh, you guys can't see it but uh, let me just show you real quick so it tells you how many bridges there are total so we have three of them and you just gotta find it. However, you are on a time limit, so once you start this stabilizer, like the blue stuff starts closing in, and you gotta do it quickly, otherwise, uh, you fail. So I've noticed that the, uh, oh, I already failed this one, because I went the wrong way. Yeah, fine. It's on every map, so you just kinda, sometimes you go the wrong way and screw it up, sometimes you don't. I should be doing more of the delve stuff from previous leagues. I just, you know, just got so burnt out of it last league. But yeah, overall this league, um, I'm trying to go for the 24. The wings are kind of cool, but just, man, I wish they brought back portals when you get 36 challenges. It'd be like more 
motivating, I guess, when it gives you portals. So, Essence Trade is not really great in terms of single target. It's good for just clearing mobs and stuff. So, what you do for bosses, not only do you hit them with the normal, you hit them with a the Blight and a Wither. Uh, I don't know why I have Storm. I guess it's just for damage, but it's not really, like, important. Do some new maps. We got a tier five. I actually. Have not done this one before in terms of this league. I know what Ancient City is. It's a stupid maze that. Jesus. It's kind of like the one. I don't know how to explain it, but. It's kind of tedious. But we gotta get them all done eventually. We got an INR here. Oh my god, that thing just kinda of flew out of nowhere. may look like a stupid build, but once you get into it, it's actually pretty good. Is that still alive? No, it's dead. People only start chiseling maps when they're red, right? There's no point in chiseling white or yellows. I think if I wasn't a trickster, I would have died there. That was a great hunt, Exile. I now will write a mighty poem about it. So the reason why trickster is like considered the safer one is because you get this passive patient reaper. Recover 2% of maximum life on kill, energy shield, mana. So basically when you're AoEing everything down, you just kind of, you should be at full health unless you get bursted. That's usually how I die tend to get bursted, not like, or just like one shot by a lot of weird stuff. It's more like single target deaths than just getting wrecked. Oh, I've never seen that before. Three. 
Don't worry about picking up the loot on the ground either, because once you finish this uh, stabilizer, all the loot will drop on the ground anyway. Plus, if you have a filter, great. So what you do is go to the other stabilizers and uh, click the button. So there should be there's three on this one. It has up to four bridges. So your primary goal is to finish before uh, you get overrun. And once you're done, you can speed up the collapse and then kill everything. I think we got the map done here. Breach is in a weird spot. Oh my god. Got that. Still don't know what this is. Rear guard. Uh, sh that does not look good. But yeah, this map is a maze. I didn't really like it during the story either. Once you go below 50, we're out. you made it back. May your maps be merciful. Let me Why did I pick that up? I don't know. Alright, let me see. What do we need now? We could do a tier 6 pit, graveyard, mausoleum. Let's do be a little bit careful with this map just because I don't know the mods on it. Oh my god, dude. Frick 
fucking betrayal mechanics. Where are you even going? To the victor go the spoils. I've nothing to hide. Only strength matters. I like betrayal. It's just it kind of got stupidly tedious. So if you die in the fragment, you apparently get sent back to town or to your like hideout. So I usually try to save them till the end if I can uh, avoid it. Ow. I need lot of random stuff okay two bridge this one means you get one choice to go left or right oh I screwed that one up This was the problem with my original betrayal. <laughs> like, you don't do damage until you're geared, and then they appear way too often. These things hurt. Perfect. Yeah, we're gonna be avoiding syndicates for a while now. Mind over matter. Still gets wrecked. I kind of wish the syndicates appeared less often. <laughs> Even on like lower tier maps, I don't try not to do other stuff. They appear in like waves. There's still more than 50 here. I think we should be almost done. Ooh, a trial. Please, please, something I actually need. No, it gave me piercing truth again. Dude, I've found five trials total, and then they're all the same too. Not only that, piercing trial is one of the worst ones too. Normally I would do it. Just, oh my god, just give me something new. Hello. <laughs> nice. See you soon. 
Just need the rare one and we're good. Tier 2, do I have a strand map? I do have a strand map. I think the boss of this one is the golem. Oh no, it's a uh, triple plate. Two bridge. Hmm. Intelligence. This is energy shield. Mana, fire resist. Man, you'd have to, like, do some hard crafting for that one to be good. The reason why I ID these is because of the uh, challenge. You need to ID about a thousand of them. And that's tedious. And we need seven more memories, which is one we'll just get over time. I'm not sure what percentage I was before I died to the syndicate thing, but uh, probably got her 10% back. As long as I'm killing things, I should be okay. That moment when you actually do need portal scrolls and wisdom scrolls. Is there a challenge for getting a gem to level 20? I don't think so.
easy clear. Alrighty, so the way this works, I really do need to organize this. But it's like you combine three of the same items into a new one. So I'll show you how that works in a second. Let me clear out my inventory. Welcome. Fate will find you. So let's say we have three two-handed axes, right? And we have three bows somewhere. One, one bow, two bow, three gloves and three shields. Okay, so I have three shields. So what you're gonna wanna do is go to your memory nexus. You can talk to the NPC dude. Go to the synthesizer in the middle, just throw up three of them and synthesize it. And it gives you a fragmented one. So this is the fragmented one. Just look at the little picture at the top or next to the names and then this is a synthesized one. So then you can do the same thing over and over. Hmm. 14 to all elemental resistances. Um, 52 to life. 8 lightning resist. Fortunately, this one is just straight up better. I mean, I'm using a shield as a stat stick. Or... Stat shield. Oh, hello. But yeah. That's pretty much the league. And then there's the whole like connector map thing that we'll get into next time. So with that said, I'll see you guys in a bit. Thanks for watching.